What the do you race. make of the race right now? This new New York Times CBS News poll showing it uh, very it's, closing. You know, and I then never... yesterday, Bob, we had a poll that shows that he was ahead in some key swing states. Well, yes, I, I think I think this poll is devastating for Hillary Clinton. I just don't think there's any other way to put it because now he has opened up a big lead among independents. Independents are the people who are going to decide this race. I mean, I keep hearing about Democrats worried about, you know, how do we get to the, the Bernie Sanders people? How, do, how does uh, Hillary Clinton get to the left of Bernie Sanders? I think it's in the middle where she's got to work on getting people, and this, this poll really shows it. I mean, think about this. We have managed to come up with two people here on the Republican and the Democratic side that a majority of Americans don't like and, and even worse, don't trust. Mm -hmm. Uh, I mean, how, how, how does that happen? I mean, it seems to me that the, the, the main appeal of both candidates now is that they're not the other candidate. Right. So you know, are her you hear numbers people going over down? and over saying, I right. can't vote for Hillary, so I'm going to have to vote for Trump. I don't like him, but I'm going to vote for him. Or you hear people say, I, I don't like Hillary, yeah. uh, I don't like Trump, so I'm going to have to vote for Hillary. It's nobody that's that's positive here. Bob, are her numbers going down and his going up? Is that what you're his saying? His numbers are kind of holding pretty steady as far as the the trust and likability. What is it? Uh, Thirty three percent of the people don't trust him, uh, but twenty eight percent of the people. I mean, do trust him. Mm -hmm. Only twenty eight percent of the people trust her. I mean, that's, that's, I mean, in a country of 340 million people, yeah. this is how we, we wind up this thing. I You've don't been... think we've ever had a choice quite like this. You've been to every convention since? 1968. 19... Democratic. <laughs> that's uh, right. This will be my, what, 25th if I get if I'd live to get to the Democratic Convention, it would be my <laughs> 25th convention.